Hello and welcome to another episode of today's Shike. Let's begin. CERN, European Council for Nuclear Research, is located on the border of France and Switzerland. Is the correct answer? Recently, the CERN announced that the Large Hadron Collider Beauty experiment has observed a new kind of pentaquark and the first ever pair of tetraquarks. CERN is the European Organization for Nuclear Research, which runs the particle accelerator complex that houses the LHC. the world's largest and most complex collider it was founded in 1954 and sits astride the franco swiss border near geneva recently mathewara forest was in the news it is located near which of the following rivers satluj is the correct answer the people of punjab and environmental activists are protesting against the state government's decision to set up an industrial park near the mathewara forest It's located near Punjab's largest river the Satluj and its largest city Ludhiana it offers valuable ecosystem services to the people of the state consider the following statements regarding co-location facility co-location is data center facility where third parties can lease space for servers and the national stock exchange introduced co-location facilities in 2013 only first is correct is the correct answer an eminent bureaucrat is under the enforcement directorate scanner in connection with the national stock exchange co-location scam it is a data center facility where third parties can lease space for servers and computer hardware and they provide infrastructure like power supply bandwidth cooling for setting up servers and storage of data nse introduced co-location facilities in 2009 kiru hydroelectric power project is located in which of the following states or union territories jammu and kashmir is the correct answer recently cbi conducted searches at 16 location in connections with a case alleging irregularities in civil works related to kiro hydroelectric power project kiro hydroelectric power project is proposed on river chenab in kishtwar district of jammu and kashmir and the project is envisaged as a run of the river scheme the foundation stone for the hydroelectric power plant was laid in february 2019 while completion is expected by 2023 which of the following countries is not included in the horn of africa nigeria is the correct answer Four consecutive failed rainy seasons have left more than 18.5 million people in acute food insecurity across the Horn of Africa region. The World Food Programme warned that the number might go up to 20 million by the end of 2022. Horn of Africa is the easternmost extension of African land, consisting of Djibouti, Eritrea, Ethiopia, Somalia. Who among the following successfully administered the first vaccine against rabies, a zoonotic disease? Louis Pasteur is the correct answer. Recently, Indian Immunologicals Limited organized a nationwide pre-vaccination campaign against zoonotic disease on account of World Zoonosis Day 2022. It's observed annually on June 6th to commemorate the first immunization against a zoonotic illness. The day was instituted on 6 July 1885. On 6 July 1885, French biologist Louis Pasteur administered the first dose of the vaccine. against rabies a zoonotic disease and diseases can that can transmit from animals to human beings are known as zoonotic diseases mangar hillock is in rajasthan recently national monuments authority submitted a report on declaring mangar hillock in rajasthan as a monument of national importance it's a hillock in banswara district of rajasthan and also the local bheel tribals had been demanding the mangar hills to be declared as a national monument at which of the following places A three-day Akhil Bharatiya Shiksha Samagam was inaugurated recently. Varanasi is the correct answer. Recently, Prime Minister of India inaugurated a three-day Akhil Bharatiya Shiksha Samagam at Varanasi, and it is being organized by the Ministry of Education in association with University Grants Commission and Banaras Hindu University. It will provide a platform for higher education institutions to share insights on strategies and best practices in implementing the national education policy. The key highlights of Samagam will be the adoption of Varanasi Declaration on Higher Education and will showcase India's extended vision and a renewed commitment to help achieve the goals of higher education system. With reference to the sodium ion, that is Na ion batteries, consider the following statements: They are costlier than lithium batteries and they can be totally discharged to zero volt. Sodium is not naturally abundant material on Earth and they can be charged rapidly. so we have to select the answer from these given options only two statements are correct so moving on recently scientists from 
IIT Khadakpur have used nano materials to develop NAI and batteries and supercapacitors and it was supported from the technology mission division of the department of science and technology these sodium materials are cheaper than lithium based materials high performing and can be scaled up to industry level production the nai in cell can be totally discharged to zero volt making it a safer option in comparison to many other storage technologies sodium is among the most abundant natural elements on the earth and one of the advantages of the battery is that they can be charged rapidly the term wostihen is associated with sociology is the correct answer the concept of wostihen which loosely translates to understanding in german was made popular by max weber one of the founding fathers of sociology it requires researchers to place themselves in the position of the individual observed to see and comprehend the meanings behind person's action and this becomes important as actions can have different meanings in different cultures and societies without proper investigation one is at risk of misinterpreting the data collected zero click technique is related to hacking is the correct answer as the name suggests the zero click hacking technique does not require any action by the targeted phone user it can remotely infiltrate a device with the help of spyware to gain entry the software identifies zero day vulnerabilities meaning flaws in the os that is operating system that are not identified yet and hence have not been patched instead of exploiting human error it banks on flaws in the software and hardware system to gain access to a device apple inc plans to release a new feature called lockdown mode that aims to add a new layer of protection india's first ever animal health summit was held at the correct answer should be given from the given options this is our practice question answer it correctly thank you so much for watching